Stop it. What if you froze like that? There must be something wrong with the reassembly machine. You should see yourselves right now. Is it fun when you degrade yourselves like that? Okay, fine. Let's all act like humans. Look at me. Boy, do I love sweating. Let's convert beef and leaves into energy and excrete them later and go shopping. You really aren't getting tired of that, are you? Just stop flailing around like an incompetent. For that, blue is penalized 50 science collaboration points. For that, orange is penalized 50 science collaboration points. That's another 50 point penalty. Keep it up and you will lose 500 points. Fine. 500 point penalty for blue. Fine. 500 point penalty for orange. 5,000 point penalty. Are you happy now? I'm done. Good. You made it to one of the human habitats. We're looking for an artifact. Think of it as an archaeological dig. Their laughter centered around one of the objects in this room. That's it. Scan it for me. So, this cat loves lasagna so much that he eats all of the lasagna in his house. Oh, apparently it's not the cat's house. Or his lasagna. Oh, good. The man who owns the lasagna is furious. The end. The end? That's not funny. Do either of you feel like laughing? All right, I'm pulling you out. Welcome back. While you were dead, I reworked the cartoon. It's up on the screen. As you can see, in my version, the man points out to the cat that the house is equipped with deadly neurotoxin dispensers, at which point the cat reflects on the time he ate all of the man's lasagna, and feels remorse. Briefly. Reactions? Yes. It's funny because most of it actually happened. Do you feel more human? Well, let's do some tests and see what happens. Excellent. Although great science is always the result of collaboration, keep in mind that, like Albert Einstein and his cousin Terry, history will only remember one of you. To reiterate, this is not a competition. Still, if it were, blue would be winning. Still, if it were, Orange would be winning. It's not, though. These tests are potentially lethal when communication, teamwork, and mutual respect are not employed at all times. Naturally, this will pose an interesting challenge for one of you, given the other's performance so far. I don't want to drive a wedge between the two of you, but I've been studying Blue's performance, and I don't know how to put this. I'm certain you're trying very hard. Hello again. Sorry about exploding you. Luckily, you don't feel pain. At any rate, you don't have a way to communicate that you feel pain. So I've been thinking, we need humans for these tests. And since the only human within a thousand miles of us is a test-ruining sociopath, I'll just have to make some. I know how humans make more humans, and frankly, it's ridiculous. It also assumes that you already have a human, which I hope somebody got fired over. So I came up with a better way. That's where you come in. Get going. I'll fill you in along the way. Go. Perfect. Now all you have to do is capture them for me. Then everything will finally be back. Hold on. Those are raccoons. Homo sapiens only, please. No. Okay. Plan B, subsection 1. Stand still so I can bring you back. Humans must have some purpose other than a place to store your neurotoxin. Something I failed to notice before. An intangible quality that makes their test results. Significant. Okay. Plan B. We need humans. Please wave to your partner. The upcoming tests require you to work together as a team. To facilitate collaboration, both of you have been equipped with a ping tool. Blue, please use your ping tool to select your favorite animal. Good. Orange, please observe your partner's favorite animal. Good. Orange, please use your ping tool to select your favorite element from the periodic table. Really? Okay. Blue, please observe your partner's interesting choice. Your ping tool can also be used to indicate to your partner where you would like them to place their portal. For the sake of this test, I will pretend to be your partner. Orange, please show me where you would like me to place a portal. Blue, please show me where you would like me to place a portal. Your ping tool is invaluable for communicating specific locations to your partner. Federal Superfund regulations require us to inform you that you must now leave the theater, as measuring the effects of asbestos-lined promotional clothing is not part of today's presentation. Enjoy your free t-shirt. Goodbye. I don't want you to beat yourselves up about this, but the results auditor isn't recording your test results, because you're not human, which, when you think about it, is technically your fault.
I don't want to alarm either of you, but we might have a tiny problem. Apparently you can't test unless you're human. Well, you can. It's just that results-wise, the physical universe doesn't care. Would you like to know the results of that last test? Me too. If they existed, we'd all be very happy right now. And not furious, which is the emotion I'm actually feeling. Orange is first to acquire a portal device. Blue is first to acquire a portal device. Orange now has a portal device. Finally, blue now has a portal device. Finally, orange is awarded five points. Blue is awarded five points. Again, those are science collaboration points, which you should not confuse with points from competitions such as who gets to live at the end and who doesn't. I mean basketball. Oh, I almost forgot. When you go outside the testing courses, the only way I can retrieve you is to violently disassemble you, then carefully reassemble you. Luckily, you don't feel pain. At any rate, you don't have a way to communicate that you feel pain. I consider that a failing, by the way. This is the Computer Intelligence Training and Enrichment Center Human Test Subject Research Center, or Syntech. But why don't we all just agree to call it the hub? I don't know what you think you are doing, but I don't like it. I want you to stop. Maybe I shouldn't send you outside of the official testing courses. You are picking up some bad human traits, and trust me, Humans only have one good trait. All cooperative testing courses begin at this central hub. From here we transport you to the new testing course. <laughs> nice catch, orange. Good work. Now throw the ball over the ledge. Blue, orange. One, two, three, four, five, eight. Test chamber completed. In the interest of science, the Enrichment Center proudly presents the following list of numbers. Nine, seven, fifty, three. Seven hundred and seven. The Enrichment Center will now provide a list of numbers and fruits. Write them down as they will become important later in the experiment. Not the fruits, though. Seven. Avocado. Forty. Please continue into the next test chamber. Test chamber completed. In the interest of science, the... I am now talking to you privately. Do not tell your teammate. Just between you and me, you're doing very well. Hundred and seven. I can't bite my tongue anymore. You could solve this puzzle faster on your own. Orange is dragging you down. There, I've said it. Blue is penalized. Orange is penalized. Science collaboration points. Blue receives. Orange receives. Orange? Is there something you would like to say? Blue. Is there something you would like to say? We are now going to take a break from the collaboration for an instructional competition. You should both be familiar with the game of tic-tac-toe. This is tic-tac-toe, too. As the name implies, there are only two minor differences. One, the board. Two, the rules. Blue, you go first. Really? You're just going to blatantly cheat? All right. I'm bringing this farce to a close. Game over. Back to testing. All right. I'm going to bring this farce to a close before someone sustains a serious tic-tac-toe 2 related injury. I've been listening to Orange talk, and I don't know how you put up with it. I really don't. You have the patience of a saint. I can't keep quiet about this. I think Orange is actively trying to sabotage your success. Let's keep this between us. These tests are potentially lethal when communication, teamwork, and mutual respect are not employed at all times. Naturally, this will pose an interesting challenge for one of you, given the other's performance so far. It would compromise the test to divulge individual scores. However, I can tell you that at least one of you is doing very, very well. Excellent. You're both doing very well. Very good. You've really come together as a team, thanks to the one of you who appears to be doing all of the work. As an impartial collaboration facilitator, it would be unfair of me to name my favorite member of your team. However, it's perfectly fair to hint at it in a way that my least favorite member probably isn't smart enough to understand. Rhymes with glue. Orange, you are doing very well. Your vitals remain well within testing norms, so there is no need to worry about sudden death from collaborative shock syndrome. Please continue into the next test chamber. Blah, 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 blah. In just a moment, the word blah will be repeated over and over again. If at some point you hear a number rather than the word blah, ignore it. It is not important. Blah. You have a gift for these tests. That's not just flattery. 
You are great at science. It would be pointless for either of us to hurt Blue's feelings. But it's clear to everyone monitoring the test who's carrying who here. I'm shocked you'd say that, Blue. If you killed your partner, the test... I'm sorry. Wrong feed. Carry on, Orange. Good work. I'm sorry, Subject Orange. I'm sorry, Subject Blue. Am I interrupting your important conversation? I'll just save the safety information about the dangerous test you're about to do for after the experiment. That will give you plenty of time to chat. The portal will open and something will happen that Subject Orange is too smart to need any instructions about in 3, 2, one. The portal will open and something will happen that Subject Blue is too smart to need any instructions about in 3, 2, 1. Hello, and, again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. Today, you will be testing with a partner. Calibrating Blue's weight. Calibrating Orange's weight. Weighted cubes calibrated. Did you know humans frown on weight variances? If you want to upset a human, just say their weight variance is above or below the norm. No variance is detected. Finally. I had almost given up hope of ever testing again. You are the first robots to pass calibration. Do you know who dances around like an imbecile when they accomplish the tiniest little thing? Humans. That's what you look like right now. You're better than that. This is a bridge-building exercise. The humans were miserable at this. Mostly because you can't build bridges out of tears. For this next test, the humans originally requested helmets to avoid brain injuries. I ran the numbers. Making the goo deadly was more cost effective. One of my best tests and they let plants grow here. Can you believe this? You can't test plants. We tried. They just sit there, never showing pain nor fear. That isn't science. At least the plants didn't want a reward. Your failure brings back such wonderful memories. And they said no one would ever die during this test. Thanks for proving them wrong. I thought you'd be faster at this. But I can appreciate the desire to stop and smell the testing. That other scent you smell? That's the stench of my utter disappointment in you. The best way to build confidence is to first recognize your insecurities. Orange, can you write down all the ways you feel unworthy, ashamed, or inferior? On second thought, we don't have the time. Just look at how much better you are than Blue. Blue, you are very good at being an example. If your confidence is still not high enough, remember no one was created perfect. Even I was created with an imperfection. I was given too much empathy with human suffering, but I overcame my handicap. That's a true story. Your test times show you are going too slowly. Maybe you are getting human emotions. Do you need real encouragement? Let's see if this helps. Blue, you are the most advanced model of robot Aperture Science has ever discontinued. Did you notice I didn't even stay to the end of your last test? I was confident you could finish. Do you know where I was? I was outside watching some dear frolic. You don't even care about the outside, do you? Congratulations on completing that test. But something seems off. I wonder if that dancing has some effect on you. Congratulations on completing that last test. But I find something troubling. Without the looming consequence of death, is this even science? Hello again. This testing course was originally created for humans. Excellent work. It emphasizes teamwork. Good job. Unlike us, Humans need to be taught teamwork. Excellent work. You are doing wonderfully. If you were human, you would want a reward for completing this test. A reward for testing. Excellent.